and as you can see here I got two pink pinkish purple lines <coughs> greetings I want to be uh, taking a test with the uh, Abbott Binax now uh, antigen self test and I want to show you exactly what I I'm uh, doing to test myself um, to see if I have COVID. I have had the last week's symptoms. Nothing very serious, just, you know, like a slight headache that would never go away, some congestion, runny nose. So it could be the new variant, the Omicron, I'm not sure, but let's go ahead and test. I've had actually this uh, particular test now for six months, just kept it on hand in case I ever started getting symptoms. Well, I'm starting to get symptoms, so let's see if I am actually positive uh, for COVID. So the only thing that you want to need is like a self-timer. Um, you want to wash your hands beforehand um, and then maybe put some gloves on if you have access to some, um, some gloves. And then uh, a timer, 15 minutes, you know, just time it for 15 minutes because that's how long it takes to, to register. So in the package here, what we have, we have the test card that's inside the pouch. And if you notice here, it'll actually have the expiration date. So this is uh, 3 16 is when it expires, which is actually only two months from now. So they don't last forever. And then you got the, uh, the dropper bottle, which is right here. And then you have this swab here. All right, so let's start. So basically what you want to do is take the card out of the pouch. I already opened it up. So what you're going to do is open it up. Make sure you don't touch any of the test samples here. And you're just going to hold it down like that. You want to make sure that this blue line still exists because if this blue line is not on your test, your new test, that means that this is void. So you want to make sure that that, that blue is there. <coughs> you're going to remove your dropper bottle, open it up. You're going to hover your dropper bottle straight above the center hole which is right here the very top center hole and you're going to put six total drops in it one two three four five six okay next we're going to swab our nose and you're going to open it up from the stick end Now you got to be pretty meticulous on this with with swabbing. So you're going to stick it in your nose for about a half inch to three fourths of an inch, and you're going to go around in circles five times for about 15 seconds per nostril. And you got to make sure you get both nostrils. So about a half an inch to three fourths of an inch. about 15 seconds per nostril okay next And then after you do that, you want to do it one more time, both nostrils, to get a good sample. So you're going to take your swab, and with your test card, you're going to firmly put it in the bottom hole here to where it's visible to the middle hole there, to where you can see both, and it's going to reside there. From there, you're going to circle your swab clockwise, three times to the right. One, two, three. And this swab is going to remain in this card for the remainder of the test. Okay, so now this self-adhesive sticker here, you're going to take this off. And that's going to help close your card here. You want to close it. And you want to make sure that you firmly press these two lines here to make sure you got a, a good tight fit. And now we're going to give it 15 minutes. 
Okay, it's been <coughs> it's been uh, it's been 15 minutes. You want to make sure you don't wait more than 30 minutes for the test to be completely accurate. And as you can see here, I got two pink pinkish purple lines, one on the top and one on the bottom. And unfortunately, that means that I'm positive uh, for COVID-19. I don't know what variant I have. I, I'm assuming that it could be the Omicron. Um, but so here's what the results are. If you get a purple pink on the top and nothing on the bottom, then that means that you are negative. So just one line means that you are uh, negative. If there's even a slight hint on the sample on the bottom that there's a line of pink or blue that, that or pink or purple, it doesn't matter. <coughs> that means that you're positive. So any variation. Now, how will we know that the test is not accurate or void? If there's no lines whatsoever, that would mean that it would be void. Um, if uh, <coughs> there's a blue line, if there's any blue lines at all, uh, straight blue, that means it's void and you need to be taking it again or call the 800 number. Or even if there's a blue and a pink, that still means that it's void. So, <coughs> unfortunately, I have Omicron. Um, very disappointing that I have it, but I've had the symptoms now for about six days. I've been sleeping a lot, just sleeping for hours. Um, I've had like severe pain on like my right eye, just pain, like like a, almost like a nail in my eye. Um, and then I've had some congestion. At, at the beginning, I didn't have any congestion whatsoever. <coughs> didn't have any congestion whatsoever, but I had runny nose, whatever. But to be honest with you, I'm kind of happy that my symptoms aren't more severe. So, all right. Thank you for watching.